afternoon, everyone, and welcome to Girl Scout Tuesday. Emily and Melody are transitioning from being a part of a troop to being Juliet's in this coming year. And the reason why they're transitioning is because they want to go and explore other activities and experience other things. Emily wants to try basketball, and they both want to do soccer. Emily's also really interested in theater, and she wants to participate in some of the local school plays and musicals that they have to offer for kids her age. So we have opted to become Juliet's, and what a Juliet is is someone who is a girl who's a part of Girl Scouts, but not a part of a troop. They can still sell fall product and cookies and earn all the badges and fun patches and work on their bronze, silver, and gold awards as they age into being able to work on those, those projects. Today, we are going to start with Melody starting to earn her daisy petals. And Emily's going to do a refresher, and that's because the daisy petals are the foundation of Girl Scout. All right, now we're going to start off by reading the Girl Scout Law, and then after I read it, each of you is going to tell me what, you, what it means to you. I will do my best to be honest and fair, friendly and helpful, considerate and caring, courageous and strong, and responsible for what I say and do. Respect myself and others, respect authority, use resources wisely, make the world a better place, and be a sister to every Girl Scout. So Miss Emily, what does that mean to you? It means being kind and being friends. Okay, what about you, Miss Melody? It means to me that- Look at the camera. That, that I, that I, be caring. Now, how can you now? What's considered and caring mean? It means being friendly and helpful. Okay. Now we're going to go over the Girl Scout promise because today you guys are both earning the center for both of your badges. You have both of your badge sets. Emily, Melody, you will be earning the Daisy Center, and Emily, you'll be earning the Center to the superheroes. So, do you guys remember the Girl Scout law, uh, the Girl Scout promise? Yeah. Okay, so let's say it together. Ready? Uh, On my honor, honor I, I will honor. try to serve God, God and my country, country, to help Not people at all times, time. and to live and by the Girl, Girl Scout, Scout law. law. The Girl Scout the law. law. No. Now, what does it mean to keep a promise? Um, t to make sure you always do it and you never break it. Okay. What about you, Miss Melody? Let me think that you never tell somebody. That's a secret, but very close. Now, I'm not going to read the book out loud here on YouTube, but here's a picture of it, so you, if you wanted to, you could go out and purchase it yourself or see if your library has it to use to earn the Daisy Center. What did you think of the story? I liked it, but the parts that, that, that she did, that she broke her promise was not, oh, I don't think that was okay. No, what did you think of the story? Did you like it? No. No. Because uh, she broke all the promises. She did. She broke two promises. She broke a promise to... Well, no. She didn't break two promises. She broke one promise. Stop that, Miss Melody. What promises is, did she... What promise did she break, Miss Emily? She broke the, the promise that she promised her mother that she wouldn't go to the, to the sea. And what happened because she went to the sea? They, the gorilla grabbed, grabbed her and, uh, and, she, and she told that that told bring her brothers and sisters sisters down to the cracks cracks to the, of the sea and she did not do it so what lesson did you learn from the story that never ever break a promise what happens yeah. when you break a promise something bad might happen and someone else might get hurt yeah so now what we're going to do is we are going to make um girl scout law Keychains. 
for your book bag. Now I have them in order of how we're going to go over the petals. That concludes our Girl Scout Tuesday video for this week. We will be continuing to working on our petals until we complete all of them. And I will be throwing in a couple of our STEM badges too. Emily has a couple that she didn't earn while she was with her troop. I think there's two to three, maybe four of them. And then as soon as Emily is all done with her STEM badges, we are going to go ahead and bridge, officially bridge her to a brownie. And then we'll just have Melody, our Daisy, and Emily, our new brownie. If you liked our video, please subscribe below. And I hope you have a wonderful day. And please remember, be kind and sparkle and shine.